Next up, a fight of a different kind is taking place in the Pilbara region of Western Australia. The world's largest natural art gallery is under threat from industrial development. Video journalist Angela Bates reports. We've got a government that wants to snap huge amounts of development, mining and development all along that country. We recognise there is substantial national concern. The rock art particular is not replicated elsewhere. Some of the oldest images ever created by humans are 20,000 20 to 30,000 years old. 20,000 years ago. 30,000 years ago. Largest group of petroglyphs in the world. Oh, it is far more important than all of us. Right alongside this national treasure is Australia's biggest gas plant. The $14 billion Northwest Shelf Project. The fact is, it never had to be built here. Now Woodside wants to build another gas plant on a site nearby and move the rock. We wouldn't remove a pyramid for industry. We wouldn't remove one stone of Stonehenge for industry. We're lost enough already. A poison gas leak up north's been kept secret for three days. Ammonia gas leaked on Tuesday night. Burrup Fertilizer's ammonia plant is the largest in the world. It's only been officially open for four months. It's been four years since Living Black first reported on the ancient Aboriginal rock art. In 2007, the federal government announced national heritage listing of this region. Despite this, the area is still a hub for industry, with plans already approved by the state government for Burrup nitrates to build an ammonium nitrate production facility on the peninsula. Look, it's a place of enormous environmental value. It's incredibly important culturally to the people of that region. It's not just wriggles, it's not just lime, it's, it's more than this. It's animals, it's spirits, it's the earth, it's the wind. It's... That is our Bible. 